Doors Objects. In this lesson, we will see one more collection of objects named Doors. You will find it in the Create panel. Under Create panel, another subset is Geometry. Select Doors from this drop-down list. Here you can see different door models, which let you choose your own door's appearance. You can also keep the doors fully open, partially open, or closed. You can animate the door opening as well. Doors are mainly divided into three categories. Pivot door, hinged, joined or attached on one side only. Bifold door, hinged in the middle as well as at the side like many closet doors or sliding doors, which has a fixed half and a sliding half. You'll get a better idea when we draw them, so let's try them all. Let's draw a pivot door. Before drawing the door object, select Creation Parameters. This includes Width, Depth, Height, and Width, Height, Depth. You can choose any one as the creation procedure, that is, first width, then depth and height, or first width, then height and depth. Let's keep it at width, depth, height. Now go to the top viewport and drag. Adjust the width without leaving the mouse button and click. Then adjust the depth and click. And adjust the height and finally click. This is your pivot door. Now click on the modify panel. All the parameters are shown here. The door's height, width and depth can be adjusted from here. Check Double Door to go for a double door, and if you want to flip the opening, then check Flip Swing. This is the opening percentage for doors. There are parameters for a door frame. Next, set parameters for the leaf or door's flaps. Adjust all this as you wish. For bifold doors and sliding doors, the same procedure can be followed. Try other doors as well, and use them in your architectural models.